is the difference between slow fashion and fast fashion? Let's start by defining fast fashion. Fast fashion refers to clothing that has been produced fast and cheap by replicating catwalk trends, aka copying independent designers and fashion houses collections. At the end of the 90s, fashion started speeding up as brands were looking for new ways in which to increase their profits, leaving behind the Four Seasons framework in which fashion usually delivered new styles when the weather changed. They realized that with new garments in stores on a weekly or even a daily basis, they actively increased the appetite for fashionable clothing. And at the same time, they avoid markdowns, which cuts into margins. So they stopped replenishing their stock and instead replace items that sell out with new items, generating a collective urgency among consumers that if you don't buy it right now, you will never find it again. And oh my God, please no. Nowadays, even traditional fashion houses have more than four collections a year. They usually call it cruise or resort, just to keep up with the market. Sadly, it is only to be copied by fast fashion brands. The negative impact of fast fashion includes the use of cheap and toxic textile dyes and the pressure to reduce costs and speed up production, meaning that environmental and human rights are ignored in the name of profit. So now that you have all this info, do you really want to continue supporting this destructive business model? On the other hand, we have slow fashion, that is the movement of designing, creating and buying garments for quality and longevity. It encourages slower production schedules, fair wages, lower carbon footprints and zero waste. With slow fashion, you buy good quality and classic pieces that will last, prioritizing first a real need for a new garment, then quality over quantity, caring for the environment, protecting human rights, conscious buying, and thoughtful purchases. Slow fashion is not about never ever again buying new clothes. Rather, it's about making more informed, thoughtful decisions about our purchases. It's about actively choosing to buy less, higher quality pieces that would add value to your wardrobe and life. Now, the thing is that a distinction can be made between clothing and fashion. Clothing can be described as answering material or psychological needs, as in a coat offering warmth. Whereas fashion operates primarily at a symbolic level. We purchase fashion not because we want protection against elements. And even if this is the case, we want the garment to also be able to signify that we belong either to a group or to manifest individuality. Therefore, we do not disregard fashion because the garment is worn out, it's old or it's broken, but because it no longer communicates what we wanted to communicate. It has lost its precious link to time and space. Slow and fast fashion are commonly perceived as opposites and associated either with positive or negative qualities, depending on whether the context is financial viability or the well-being of ecosystems and people. I invite you to meditate on this subject and seek an appropriate response, taking into account the environmental challenge we face and your own real and diverse relationship with fashion. As always, if you have any questions or you would like me to explain further, please let me know in the comments down below. And thank you for being here and being part of the change. You are amazing and I will see you on my next video.